Hello Aztecs, welcome to Lesson 1, Movement. Today the focus is understanding how we move our body. Because when we think about it, we can move our body in a bunch of different ways. So let's try to figure out how and why. To understand, we're going to have to understand the definition of these five words. Muscle, tendon, bone, ligament, and joints. To move properly, all five of these have to work well together like a team. Let's start with the dictionary definition of muscle. A band or bundle of fibrous tissue in a human or animal body that has the ability to contract, producing movement in or maintaining the position of parts of the body. If that sounds complicated to you, it's because it is complicated. Take a look at this chart. That chart is nothing but complicated. Look at it this way. A muscle is like a rubber band that helps move your body. And this rubber band, or muscle, gets longer or shorter depending on what you want it to do. Muscles pull on bones to help move our body. But how are muscles attached to bones? Well, that's where a tendon comes in. The dictionary definition of tendon is a flexible but inelastic cord of strong fibrous collagen tissue attaching a muscle to a bone. Sounds complicated again, right? So let's simplify it. Let's take a look at these pictures. Simply put, tendons connect muscle to bone. Next we have the dictionary definition of bone, which isn't that difficult. Any of the pieces of hard whitish tissue making up the skeleton. This skeleton is not moving anywhere without muscles, and the muscles cannot attach to the bone without the tendon. So you can see how all these three things work together. Don't be scared, it's just a skeleton. And speaking of skeletons, how do they stay together? How do bones connect? Well, that takes us to our next definition, ligament. A ligament is a short band of tough, flexible, fibrous connective tissue which connects two bones or cartilages, or holds together a joint. Let me simplify it again. A ligament connects a bone to a bone. The pink things you're looking at, those are all ligaments, and they're connecting the bones to the bones. Last but not least, we have our final definition, joint. A joint is a structure in the human or animal body which two parts of a skeleton are fitted together. Another way to look at it is a joint is like a hinge. A hinge connects two movable points together. For example, a door connects to a wall with a hinge and it pivots around that point. This is also called a joint. As you can see, there are joints all over the body, shoulder, elbow, wrist, hip, knee, ankle, hands, feet. Any point where one or more bones meet is a joint. And without joints as pivot points, we couldn't move. We would be stiff. So in review, muscles help move the body. And muscles are like rubber bands. They contract and expand. But muscles can't move the body by itself. Muscles have to be connected to bone. The bones give your body shape, which make up the skeleton. Tendons are the thing that connect the muscle to the bone. And ligaments are the things that connect the bones to the bones. And a joint is the pivot point where two or more bones connect.
Without muscles, bones, tendons, ligaments, and joints all working together, we would not be able to move the way we move. Please go to Lesson 1, Movement, and take the quiz so that you can get credit for what you just learned. See you next lesson.